fans are hanging out here at Turner Field. It's shaping up to be a good finish, even though it is raining. Braves with the lead. We ladies trying to keep our hair looking decent. Julie Stewart banks along with me. We got to hang out in Canada covering the Women's World Cup, and now you're covering the U.S. team, the men's team at the Gold Cup, and they're playing here in Atlanta, right? Yeah, it's so exciting. I mean, the U.S. playing in the semifinals against Jamaica. They haven't really been tested a whole lot this tournament so far, and Jamaica will be a huge test because the last time they played them, it was them trying to make it to the 2014 World Cup. It was, you know, a very physical game, and they get to prove it again to try to get to the Gold Cup final. How about Clint Dempsey? Hat trick in the last one, right? I know. He's just, I mean, we've always known how good Clint Dempsey is, but even Jurgen Klinsmann said at last game that Clint is hungry for goals and we want to keep feeding him. He has two more meals, so, you know, I, I think we'll see a lot more from him. Well, I hope you enjoy your time in Atlanta. This is what, your 51st stay away from home? Yes, have not been in my apartment since May 31st. <laughs> a little bit nutty, but it's games like this. Seeing Dodgers, Braves, this is awesome. So, I mean, it's great to see you too, Jen. Oh, well, it's great to have you here. Hope you do enjoy your time and you guys can watch the U.S. in action in that semifinal in the Gold Cup that's coming up Wednesday. Coverage starts at 5.30 Eastern on FS1. Thank you, Jen. Thank you, Julie. They did a great job during the Women's World Cup. I mean, they were just terrific. So we congratulate Jen and Julie on an excellent effort last month. And now Andrew McKirahan is in a big league game with the Braves for the first time since April 19th. That was when he faced Toronto.